The emergence of artificial intelligence generated content is changing the landscape of election campaigns. Artificial intelligence programs can produce realistic images and voices in a matter of a few minutes and people have long tried to misinterpret media in order to influence an election. The International Political Campaigns Expo has commended the commitment by 20 uh, leading technology companies for working together to detect and counter harmful artificial intelligence content during upcoming elections worldwide. Glenn Bami is the host and convener of the International Political Campaigns Expo and joins us now to discuss how they plan to counter harmful artificial intelligence content during elections. Thank you so much for your time, Glenn. We do appreciate it. Such an important one because we have elections coming up in a few months. The deputy president kind of slipped and said around the 24th of May, so it's probably going to be the 24th of May. But, you know, when you think about elections, when you think about political campaigns, you don't really think about how technology can play a pivotal role in all of this. Maybe just tell us how you think it can. Thank you so much, Heidi, and it's a pleasure to be on your program and good evening to your listeners. I think part of the challenge that we have been confronted with with political campaigns is that our main actors, political parties, have not grappled with the fact that winning the heart of a voter is a science. The way a voter makes a decision in terms of who they are going to vote for is a process that has got a number of variables. And key to getting one to vote for you you have to understand data. And for the longest of time, our political parties are still stuck in traditional methods of campaigning. That's why you've got so many rallies, whistle stops, posters, and billboards. But no one has ever asked the critical questions. How do these tools shift the way a voter makes a decision and a choice?